What's up? I always make videos about the projects that I invest in. And today I would like to talk about Rebase. This looks absolutely fantastic. Um, in these kind of videos, I always like to review it uh, on cam, but I can already tell you that I like this very much. So let's dive right into it. Like the video. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel, turn the bell notification on, and let's pop up that thing right here once. Here we go, subscribe to the channel. Okay, so Rebase. This is already, um, they're already working on this because the, the token sale has been done on Pools Finance and on Dowmaker. They had a private round, they had a strategic round, KOL round, and a seed round as well. They uh, raised a total of $9 million, which is super interesting as that's an incredible high amount. And um, for the people that feel like, okay, um, you have to make me interested right away. Well, being early in crypto is key, okay? You do not even have to invest in a good project as long as you are early, X. So let alone if you are early in a project that looks really good. And in my opinion, this looks quite good. So yeah, in full transparency, I invested in this not a lot, um, just a little bit, just because I wasn't able to invest a lot. But this is actually something that I would buy on the open market as well. Now, what's pretty cool is that the the rounds for the public sale these people will get 30 percent at tge so that's quite a lot but then they have to wait for three months and they get the rest for four percent per month so it's very slowly um instead of having like huge dumps on the market and given the fact that it's now december 2023 and that there is a huge bull market ahead of us yeah that usually wins from token vesting and it is ido season um, a lot of projects you know that are now releasing they really seem to catch the hype and it's mostly game five metaverse that kind of stuff and i would really like to take a look how this looks and from what i've seen so far i'm super bullish on it um rebase thicker irl in real life also quite interesting and why is the total raise of nine million dollars bullish well that's money that they get to hopefully you know work on a product add liquidity um get good exchange listings right that kind of stuff so that's super interesting they start with a market cap of eight hundred thousand dollars yeah we have seen gamefi blow up gamefi is doing absolutely fantastic um yeah, does it really? Is it really the category game five? Well, we'll take a look at it. The fully diluted is thirty million dollars. So yeah, that's a, like a big difference. But then again, if the vesting is like not in like half a year, then it's not that I'm worried about that. If it's a long vesting, like I said, especially combined with a bull market, then I really like it. So let's go over a couple of things. And there are people um, are a couple of people that made some incredible Twitter threats uh, out of it. So we can take a look at that as well. Core technology, um, GEO located insensitives built on top of traditional GPS and H3 coordinate systems. Sounds like Pokemon Go, right? Well, th th this is actually pretty cool. So let's take a look at this. Uh, like what, what, what are the current stats and the economics and the team, etc. 10,000 plus active beta users. So that's pretty good. There is demand already. 60,000 users waitlisted and 17 collections integrated. Now, if we do take a look at the tokenomics, um, again, as an investor, you can take a look at an incredible good project. But if the tokenomics suck, then I mean, that's at the end of the day where uh, the money is. Um, and again, new projects, that's like where most of my money is going through. I can go on the open market, of course, and buy everything uh, that I like. And I do have my watch list, which is mostly GameFi, by the way. But then again, newer projects, they can do absolutely well. They get the hype, they get the narrative. They have been working on a product uh, for a long time already. And um, uh, there, there are no people yet to dump on you, right? So that's good. Um, now, if you take a look, a lot of coins are going to the team, 23%. Uh, so that's quite a lot. But we have to take a look at the vesting because as an investor, uh, that's only interesting if the team gets their tokens right away, right? And well, we have to take a look if that's actually the case. A lot of tokens are going to the ecosystem reward. So 
that's the cool thing. Most of the tokens are going there. So if you actually use the platform, then that's how you make the money as well. Um, and that's most important uh, out of this. Now you had to see it, private strategic round. They all get a little bunch of it, a public round, not really a lot. Little bit to the advisory. It's all nothing too crazy. What do they have on the roadmap? Well, a lot of things that they already have built, um, but we are now in Q4. So AR stimulants is 2.0 official launch. Rebo uh, Rebase World 2.0 official release, uh, real-time on-chain geo uh, fencing insensitive. Sorry, this is a little, a little small, and I'm Dutch, so I fuck up every word that I see anyway. Business expansion into traditional Web 2 brands and companies. Public Rebase eco uh, geolocation layer goes live. What I like about the roadmap, it is utility, utility, utility. You do not see listing. Uh, marketing like yeah okay that goes uh, with it of course if you look who the backers and the investors are this is where it's interesting we all know animoca brands of course that's really good uh they don't invest into something that they haven't researched or don't like um, but tribe capital the de uh, fine uh, defines capital spartan really really big names and cool stuff right there uh to be honest so that's already that i um feel like okay it's already big now if we do take a look at their twitter i think twitter is super important uh especially for uh for crypto related stuff and i always look like who's following them right there are some people that i follow some people from big, big projects or investors or maybe some influencers and if this list was empty i feel like yeah okay why don't you have the important eyes uh, on you but they have it um Virtual Beacon, that's by the way a guy, uh, he, he has a great YouTube channel between you and me, it's a really smart dude, uh, great at explaining stuff, I like him a lot. Um, but Mary is following them, Five Star IDO, Pools Finance, Chirply, um, some ventures, some influencers, crypto uh, graph ratings of course, but also for example, Animoca Brands of course, right? People from the Cedify team, uh, incubation and launchpad project manager from Cedify, right? Um, Cedify didn't get this one though. I don't know why, but um, yeah, it doesn't really matter. But they have the right eyes on them on on Twitter, so that's really important. As they call it themselves, Rebase is an AR adventure and move to earn app powered by Geo Technology. Rebase, the first gamified advertising platform. That's a combination of a lot of interesting things, if you ask me. Um, one this is, by the way, fully metaverse, right? But um, also gamification. Again, we all know that, uh, and I've said this in many videos, therefore I'm so happy to talk about these kind of things. What did we have in the last bull market? We had Axie, right? Now, I'm not saying that only AAA is there to uh, win, uh, matter of fact, I think that the simple, especially small mobile games are the big winner. Um, therefore, Nakamoto is doing so great. But Axie is not that great of a game. But if you look what the valuation was during the last bull market, Axie alone was just as high as the total crypto gaming market was in this bear market, right? Even higher. Therefore, I feel like, man, that's already uh, saying that crypto gaming and everything gaming related is going to be freaking huge. Uh, there are many reasons I can give you why gaming will be huge. And the recent pump in the crypto market kind of confirmed it, right? Everything was doing well. But what was especially doing well? Gaming and launch pads. It's your teaser. It's the bull market coming early saying, hey, this is what you need to buy in order to do well in the next bull market, right? And uh, off we go. Yeah, come on. Um, <coughs> also move to earn. Um, because the move to earn hype in the last bull market was a really big hype. We had to step and up and um, it was really short lived because it wasn't... Uh, developed enough it was all kind of yeah ponzi basically right you get money for moving but if you get these tokens yeah there's no real demand for it and it has been evolving rebase knows like yeah but there's more to it like if you can gamify pokemon go or if you can cryptofy pokemon go for example 
yeah come on that's huge and from what i read like hey you know with geotechnology it has something like that to it uh so yeah it's cool they're gonna release on kucoin we already know that uh there's a burning drop on kucoin starting uh from december 13 kucoin made the announcement right there so you can read the kucoin announcement and as we all know kucoin is a very uh big uh, exchange and usually kucoin listings do very well so um therefore you can uh i'm not that familiar with the burning drops but i think it's you have to stake kucoin tokens in order to kind of farm uh the the based token um so that's pretty cool they have a lot of interesting stuff on their twitter uh to be honest so they have they even have an airdrop going on um uh, do check it out it's already available by the way on uh the app store uh, and on google play so you can already use it it's also what i like right it's not a project that says like hey we are going to build this uh and 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 then we have to wait like no it's actually already doing it um what i also like is five star rdo uh, tweeted this it is huge rebase integrates with zero labs a uh, layer zero labs to unleash cross-chain potential omni-chain fungible token oft standard enables token transfer across blockchains without wrapping it burns tokens on the source chain triggering a mint on the destination chain this design used by layer zero promotes efficient cross-chain interoperability and it also is a lot safer than regular uh, regular cross-chain um, so that's pretty cool that layer zero uh, shit is like yeah i'm fucking bullish on that um wrecked guy made a very interesting uh, he's, he's he's good with twitter though <laughs> shout out man um but he made an interesting uh threat about this so very short about this you know who are the investors well we spoke about that already the token thicker the total supply um what the mission is social interaction bringing the metaverse into the real world decentralization revolutionizing web3 community users first and mechanism find to earn interesting and big free to download and play no hidden fees no paywalls explore earn earn anytime anywhere fun and loyal uh fun local and global tournaments adventure with friends so what's really interesting is a lot of projects they are uh, like play to earn but you it's actually uh pay to play and i i, I don't really like that kind of stuff uh, so you can already just use it um uh, check out everything that's been said about this man just uh check it out let's go to the website uh, really quick to see uh how it looks like we know about token vesting we know about where it's going to launch uh we know about what it does let's let's check this out real quick and i will make multiple videos about this um to really dive into it because this is a huge one and this is a huge one and yeah this uh, this this is not coverable in like 10 minutes what I like though is they make it easy because they have the button learn how to play and they have complete tutorials on how to play it. Ah, the video is private. Why did you do that? <laughs> Why did you do that? <laughs> okay, they should not make that private. I was so hyped about that. They still have it in text here, by the way. Um, but look, how does this look like, right? How does this look like? This is the Pokemon Go of crypto. And um, we know how huge that is. We know how huge that is. So I really love it. And they explain it so well. Their docs are full of information. Um, let's take a look. Yeah, we have seen this. We have seen this. Let's just go over the website real quick. Get an overview. And in the next video, I will go into detail on how it works. And maybe, but yeah, it's to move to earn. So maybe I'm just take do something different take my camera with me and just walk around play and film how uh how it goes i think that's pretty cool i think that's pretty cool um so yeah hunt for treasures all you have to do is go on an adventure walk to geolocated incentives and earn rewards so yeah for the hundredth time it is just pokemon go as you can see right here it, it looks exactly like it right and um good ideas always get copied and uh been made own right like like it, 
better it's better to 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 copy something and make it your own than do something out of nothing and that doesn't work at all uh, in my opinion and by the way like i said um the team gets a lot of tokens but the team has to wait for one year before they even get them and then they get them vested over 24 months now they do get a lot but you know for the coming year it's no problem um so it it, it actually I don't know, man. It might be really interesting to get your hands on it. They have uh, laid out exactly right here what the token utility is going to be because the project can be great, but do we need a token, right? That's always a question with a lot of crypto projects. Well, they have their governance to promote... I'm not going to read it all, but... To promote decentralized community governance for the network, IRL would allow holders to propose and vote on governance proposals. Staking, you can stake the tokens. Earning, app users will be able to earn the token for what they do on the app um, use purchasing in-game assets premium accounts nfts etc i think that this is the biggest thing right because earning a token doesn't make you uh th doesn't make the, the the buy demand go up but it makes it, it creates sell pressure of course um but actually use it and therefore you better hope that the product is going to be popular and then it's going to be used by a lot of people. And therefore, I would say, with full conviction, of course, if this game is going to be a big hit, the token will blow up completely and it will be the biggest thing ever, uh, really, right? And therefore, you do not want to step in this project and be like, when new exchange listing, when this, when, when anything finance related. No, you really want to ask like, hey, when massive adoption in the actual game right because that's what's gonna make the token uh valuable um yeah <laughs> that's my preaching and fee for adding your own geolocated insensitive points on the rebase eco uh, echo pad layer so that's also a thing now i think this is super um yeah like i said like it is of course very pokemon go ish but then again crypto hasn't done that yet and uh, crypto uh, related it is super original it is super original so when is the token coming out let's take a look if we can find something about that because that i don't know um and that's normal because it hasn't even been listed uh, or it hasn't the the, the the sale isn't even over yet so uh but l let's take a look if we can find something about that so let me see if i can jump into the telegram um which exchange will be the next one? Uh, buy, bid, pancake, swap, Uniswap, Radium. Okay, whatever. Uh, um, uh, that's one. What's the next exchange? So they really know how to hype it up. Um, let, let me search. When TGE. Look, a lot of people are asking that. So instead of asking, you can always search for it. Uh, group of people. <laughs> this month. Okay, this month. So that's December, right? So within now and two weeks, the token is also coming out. So keep your eyes on it. And you might want to go to the KuCoin announcement to see how you can get your hands on the token already. Um, because like I said, this is really, really, really interesting. Um and I, I, I think that this might be one of the bigger projects. Uh, it is really, it's a, it's a long shot, like, it, it's hard to, to now in crypto get a lot of people into such a project because most people are like, they, uh, how, how do you say this? Most people are not in crypto yet. Okay, although crypto is going up, uh, most people are not like your neighbors are not really fully talking about crypto like they did at the top of 2021, right? This is the type of project that will absolutely do fantastic if they just keep on building and a full-blown bull market is really there. And if it now just does well, then I think that could definitely uh, happen. Also interesting, by the way, 
Rebase Land is a module available for, uh, from a web application that allows you to purchase virtual plots of land as NFTs. Their counterparts are found in the real world. Um, so you can actually just you know walk around and find NFTs, which is also pretty cool. And then there are probably ways, but you have to dive, in, dive into it, uh, how you can earn from that NFT, right? Uh, the most special plot, these plots are in prime location containing the most uh, distinguished landmarks star plots are the largest in size um, and there is probably like I said a very good way uh, to earn by actually uh, sitting on those lands uh, let's take a look if we can find something wow it's so like it's really cool Solana blockchain uh, network is used to create the plots. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, nice. NFTs are stored on the Solana blockchain and the data is stored on Arweave. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, there is a lot to find. So yeah, like I said, I cannot cover this all without boring you to death with a fi five hour video. So all I can say, to be continued, keep your eyes on it. Um, I will drop the links in the description uh, down below for you to check out. But it has my interest for sure. It, it for sure has my, it's totally something different than a trading card game or anything like that. Uh, it's not easy to build something like this, not easy. Uh, and it seems like they are doing everything right for now. So, hey, please like it if you like it subscribe to the channel turn the bell notification on any questions about it drop them below i could take them into the next video